SOUTH KANSAS CITY MAN CHARGED WITH MURDERING HIS STEPFATHER MADE HIS FIRST COURT APPEARANCE TODAY. THE WIFE OF 70-YEAR-OLD HAL CORNELL FOUND HIM IN THEIR BACKYARD POOL BLUDGEONED TO DEATH. KBC 9'S PEGGY BRIGHT IS LIVE AT THE HOME ON POPLAR WITH THE LATEST INFORMATION. PEGGY? Well, and the stepson lived right back here with his mother and his stepfather. Tonight, court documents are telling us more about the circumstances of his arrest and his alleged confession to the crime. It was Tuesday when Cornell's wife called police after finding her husband's body in the pool. She had been staying with her daughter for a couple days. Neighbors tell us the stepson, 41-year-old Brian Harvey, had problems in the neighborhood. And after being questioned by police that day, he told some neighbors he had found Cornell's body days earlier and didn't know what to do. That night, Harvey went to the International House of Prayer about a mile away. People are always in the 24-7 sanctuary, and Harvey began talking with an intern. Court documents say Harvey confessed to killing his stepfather. IHOP called the police. If anybody comes to us and we hear that there is a law broken or a person harmed, then we turn everything over to law enforcement. The documents also show that Harvey told police he was building a coffin in the basement for his stepdad. Some neighbors say he told them that as well. Others say Harvey made them feel uncomfortable and seemed to be losing his grip on reality after losing his job and his car. And a couple of times he would, you know, came out of nowhere and talk, and I was a little bit, you know, concerned. Bond for Brian Harvey is set tonight at $250,000 cash. We're live at 109th and Poplar. Peggy Bright, KMBC 9 News. Harvey told police he and his stepfather argued and his stepfather pulled a gun. Harvey claims he hit the victim with a hammer and a sledgehammer and then put his body in the pool.